Hi, welcome back to Dubai Real Estate Philosophy. My name is Ahmed and in this video, we are talking about Lucky Aeon. Lucky Aeon, for those of you who haven't watched our previous video on Lucky Aeon, you can go check that video out. We were talking about the project that was coming up. It is here and we're going to discuss that project a bit more now. The first point is this is going to be an LO alternative. LO 1, 2 and 3 was a resounding success for us and Demac. It was one of the best projects that Demac has released, of course, with their amazing payment plan, their community and of course that unbeatable price that they were offering the problem was a lot of people obviously it was limited supply we have a lot of clients who signed up with eois alhamdulillah they were able to secure great units amazing units for an amazing price but of course they moved fast they took action so we were able to secure them of course again as we mentioned we do work with aeon and trissel so we do have a lot of priority and we're able to secure them a lot of units now the problem is a lot of people they did not submit the eoi they came in late or they saw the video late or they went with another brokerage and they could not secure them a unit of their life liking or a unit at all and now we have leads coming to us from youtube that are asking for elo units and unfortunately most of the good units now are sold out especially when it comes to the one bed. one bed's currently the availability i believe there's you know maybe 20 30 units that are available across the board in elo one two and three and most of them are the top floors the most expensive ones which people usually buy if they want to live in themselves they're not necessarily the best for investment because they're a bit higher priced but they do still have good two bedrooms options that are available and some remaining one beds but again all those prices are above i believe around 750,000 dirhams, which is a long shot from you know the starting price of only 580 for LO3 and 518,000 for LO1. So, anyways, if you guys have any requests for LO and still get in touch, maybe you like one of the units that are available. In my opinion, when it comes to affordable, that is still the best project I recommend because you're one developer and it's in a community those two things you really can't beat and find anywhere else for that price and that payment plan but we tried our best for all these clients that we do have who still want something in that price range but of course hello is now gone so now if you haven't noticed we don't usually just work with any developer we really try to stick with all the reputable developers we have mr the mac miras the field all these reputable brands so i don't want to show people just some crappy developer where they come and later on they don't deliver the quality and stuff and for that specific reason when it comes to budget options we have hello is the one that we recommend the most but of course those projects are now gone there's no rumors that there's going to be an lo4 there might be but there's no news right now it might be next year or something like that so for the time being we have covered lucky aeon before as well and we did that for a reason because lucky aeon is one of those developers that has these kind of pricing and they have delivered with amazing quality and amazing buildings before as well so they are coming up with a new project we'll talk a bit more about lucky aeon now they basically specialize in jvc now jumera village circle better known as jvc in dubai the very famous community well located is close to marina close to all these things close to the hot spots not downtown and stuff but obviously it's a bit on the side of course we are looking at affordable and value oriented apartments downtown all those things they are very mature now they're super luxurious now so you can find these kind of pricing over there so this is in my opinion the best lo alternative that's available right now in the market of course the pricing is still as not great as lo but it's as close as we can get while still maintaining quality and with a reputable plan of course we can find two for two hundred fifty thousand. but i mean terrible construction bad quality no management at all you have to look at these things i mean i have heard nightmare stories of previous clients or new clients who had previous brokerages they bought in unreputable brands the developer ran away halfway through the construction they sold it to someone else now that someone else is maintaining it but there's no management people they rent it from them they're subleasing it on i mean it's a terrible nightmare you don't want to deal with all these things that's why you want to go with a reputable brand a reputable developer but the prices are too much but in my opinion this is the best value you can get with something that is close to buy of course LO3 was in the Macros 2, which is a bit further out. And of course, they're a tier one developer worth billions of dollars they can afford with economies of scale to give it at these prices. So these prices aren't that great, but let's get into the project now. Enough of me talking about it and see what it's about. Now, speaking a bit more about the JVC area, as you can see the location over here on the maps, it's very centrally located. And RTA, of course, is building a new highway over there. Not new, but Hesa Street is getting a massive upgrade, a massive extension in the future. Of course, there are bus routes over there. There's going to be metro connections, all these things. So it's a very happy area very well known area there's a lot of schools a lot of hospitals very hustle and bustle mature community so it's not something that's going to be far out very quiet something like that but that gives you a good rental opportunity good resale opportunity especially with a trusted brand like lucky aeon one of the best things about lucky aeon is that all the one beds two beds and the three beds they come with a maid room or a study room this is something that's very unique to this developer every single apartment obviously not in the studios but the one two and three beds they do come with a study room or a maid room it's basically a 
multi-purpose room you can use it for whatever else but you do get that extra storage as well so as you can see this is the rendering of lucky aeon one of the things that they have a specific design ethos most of their lucky aeons buildings they look really similar you know it's very uh, contemporary modern style and they do have all these balconies of course one of the you know cool things that they had in this project as well was also have lunch pools they do have some units that also do have lunch pools in the balcony now one of the other things lucky aeon is very well known for is their world of amenities now over here you can see there are over 21 amenities just in this building we're looking at gaming facilities a library business center kids pool you know play area fitness studio you name it and they have it signs of a quality developer moving on with the amenities of course you can see some of the things we have a stunning podium garden we of course have an infinity pool indoor kids play area a rooftop terrace garden again as i mentioned the private plunge pools in some of the units that are there and of course we have a barbecue gazebo area splash pad we have something very unique that is they have something called a hospitality suite now this is a very cool concept that they came up with let's say you have some guests coming over to dubai you live in lucky aeon you don't want them to live with you of course let's say you're living in a one bed what you can do is lucky aeon has a hospitality suite you can book it in advance and have your guests stay over there rather than in your house with themselves or them having to pay extra money elsewhere in a hotel very cool design it was very successful in their previous building so they're bringing that feature back into this latest project as well now as i mentioned over here again you can see the location and the accessibility jumara village circle very centrally located they're showing some of their previous projects as well we're only 20 minutes away from palm jumara 15 minutes from Burj Al Arab. of course the dubai international airport is very close by and downtown is only 20 minutes away as well so very centrally located that this is one of the plus points comparing it to elo basically was a bit more far off than this location so this is definitely one of the plus points now moving on you can see over here the kitchen is going to be fully fitted it's going to be fitted by european kitchens of course air conditioner we're using the york brand and of course the doors are fire resistant as well again you can see some of the fixtures and fittings over here the tiles again european porcelain tiles we're using the grand very nice black aesthetic bathroom fixtures and fittings over here you can see the floor plan of the studio apartment it's very standard layout i mean honestly with a studio apartment you really can't change much in terms of innovation or anything like that so fairly standard over here you can see the one bedroom apartment and again they do have a show apartment as well we'll be showing some of the rendering for that as well over here you can see as soon as you enter on the right hand side you do have that extra study room or extra maid room it is large enough to be a maid room as well so definitely that is one of the plus points that they do have over here you can see the two bedroom again with that maid or study room as you can call it fairly well designed you have a private terrace of course this unit has a private plunge pool option as well they do have some units that are available with this option as well now they do have something very unique as well they have a three bedroom sky villa apartment as well now this is going to be a triplex so we do have a ground floor first floor and a terrace this is something that's uh very nice very unique that they have come up with as you can see over the floor plans over here and they do have availability for these units as well along with a four bedroom sky villa as well so if you guys have any questions about those you can reach out and we can discuss further now this is going to be the show apartment over here you can see this is the actual show apartment model that they have created this is of course the living room we're looking at the fully fitted kitchen over here again you can expect this kind of uh, same quality same design same finishing in the actual product as well again this is another angle for the kitchen you can see very nice finishing very high-end materials used as well of course this is a picture of the bedroom uh, that they have outlined you know the walk-in uh, closet and of course over here we can see the bathroom again you can see the high quality and of course the high building maintenance and last but not least this is your extra room which you can use as a study room or a maid room as you can see in this mock-up it is decently sized and you can use it whatever way you want now getting to the last and most important point this has a better payment plan than elo it is going to be a 60 40 payment plan so for those of you who knew elo at the launch day was 70 30 of course now if you try to book any unit it's going to be 80 20 again we can kind of request them to make it to 70 30 but that is a whole other process but lucky eon is offering 60 40 of course it is not as convenient as the lo one percent payment plan it is kind of similar so uh, you can see the breakdown right now basically you pay 10 percent on the booking then 10 percent in 30 days and 10 percent in 180 days and then we have basically five percent every quarter until the handover and the handover will be in q4 of 2026 and of course at that moment we will have 40 percent remaining to pay which of course you can finance with the bank as well ideally you can only pay 60 percent once 60 percent is ready we can rent it out we can sell it and then the 40 percent you can finance easily with the bank even if you're an international client and that way you have the best cash flow available you can start earning rental income 
and of course try to pay off the mortgage with that as well that is definitely one exit option that is available as well speaking about the most important part the studio pricing will start from around 630,000 dirhams the one bed that will be starting from around 1 million the two beds will be starting from around 1.2 million the three beds will be starting from around 1.9 million now i know most of you are saying that oh hello was very very different and they only had one and two beds again this is why i was preaching in the beginning that hello is such a great project because you had one beds and two beds available at those crazy insane prices but we have to understand the mac is a tier one developer they're worth billions of dollars they bought the mac hills 2 20 years ago and with their economies of scale in construction they can afford those kind of pricing and those kind of things but that opportunity has passed and the closest we can get to that price of you know 580,000 is around 630,000 even though this is a studio but look it's all relative right you might have gotten a one bed in the mac hills 2 for that price and it would rent for 40 to 50,000 the more you spend the more income you will also generate so at the end of the day the numbers always make sense if you have a trusted developer again on any off-plan project you can expect 20 to 30 percent capital appreciation once it's handed over and of course once it is handed over ideally realistically you should expect anywhere from five to six percent on rental yield that is the same for elo that is the same for jvc of course in elo there is a lot more capital appreciation opportunity because it's a bit further off and of course there's a lot more construction that's going to happen same thing can be said about jvc there's a lot more construction the hessa street highway extension there's going to be more bus routes metro connections all these things so it will gain some capital appreciation not as much as elo that's why i still recommend elo to be the best but if 750,000 is a bit too high rather than keeping that money why would you keep that money in the bank why would you invest it somewhere else real estate is very safe it's stable it's not like cryptocurrencies or something like that or stocks or ETFs. If, if you don't understand those things it's fine it's it's simple you buy it rather than putting that money in the bank or investing it somewhere else you can put it for 633,000 in a studio if you're looking for investment it doesn't matter if it's a studio or one bed what the view is as long as you're guaranteed to make the returns you're guaranteed to make a capital appreciation again i understand it's more of an emotional decision but as investors we have to look at it from a perspective that okay you know we are putting this investment and what are going to be the numbers we're going to be doing now for the people who actually want to live in it or, you know for some time or they want to airbnb it it's a great option as well i mean one bed starting from around 1.04 million that's a great price 60 40 payment plan you can't really go wrong with that 40 percent you can find it and it's close to everywhere you want jvc is very well connected you're close to the marina you're close to downtown and you're right smack in the middle of the city as we mentioned in previous videos as well Makhum airport is coming up so the growth in dubai is naturally happening that way and jumeirah village circle is again in the center of that so you can be rest assured you'll be close to Makhum airport expo while along still being connected with that side of dubai when it comes to downtown and all those things so it's very well located strategically located so if you're looking for it to airbnb it if you're looking for it to live in it yourself i recommend as i said in the beginning of this video we don't cover any developer i only like to cover developers that i have confidence in because it's my reputation on the line as well and later on when you're going to actually get the handover i will have to rent it for you i will have to resell it for you if the developer is not good and i'm having a tough time renting it out or i'm having a tough time reselling it out obviously my clients are not going to have confidence in me it is my responsibility to give them some product that is respected that is, is going to you know deliver on the quality it makes my job easier as well because i have clients that come to me and they're like you know em and i bought this in for example someone i'm not going to name any names but some developers in jvc i want to rent it out it was a tough process to rent it out you have to go to court because the developer is not giving it to you and then now the guy's renting it from you they're subleasing it now there are two three people living in it so all these kind of management issues they come from the developer side if the developer is not sincere with their investment if they're not sincere in quality especially if you want to live there you don't want to live there and right next to you there's like four people living in the same room they're all like taxi drivers now, nothing against taxi drivers but obviously it's a vibe we want something that's family oriented it's good for investment all these things combined lucky aeon i believe is one of those products because i've seen their products we've had great success with them in the previous years as well so it's something i can highly recommend it's great if you're looking for an elo alternative it's great if you're looking for something that's low budget obviously in dubai you go to tier one i mean mr one bed starting from 1.7 1.8 not everyone wants to go that high of course it's an entry point this is a great entry point in my opinion so if you guys have any questions about this project feel free to let me know in the comment section down below thank you so much for watching this video i'll see you guys in the next one goodbye for now and you can conveniently reach out to me directly on my whatsapp by scanning the qr code at the top right corner